I'm Brianna, and you're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. Dante's Boxing Nation, what's going on guys? So after Keith Thurman survived that seventh round and beat Tolcito Lopez, Danny Garcia calls him out for a rematch. Danny, he went to one of his social media accounts and he simply just posted the word rematch. So we obviously know what that means. Boy, I tell you, there's no doubt in my mind that when Danny Garcia is calling out the likes of Keith Thurman, he must really feel that he's seen some holes in Keith Thurman's game against Josito Lopez because this is not Danny Garcia's style. Danny Garcia, he never just calls out top welterweights on his own. Now, he may mention names in interviews when he's been pressed on who he wants to fight, but for him to post one of his own comments saying that he wants to fight someone, I mean, that's damn near Terrence Crawford style right there. But who knows? Keith Thurman struggling against Josito Lopez in that round, that may be the best thing that could have happened to Keith Thurman. Because if you guys recall, Keith Thurman, he had chased Danny Garcia for damn near two years. It was not easy for Keith Thurman to get Danny Garcia in the ring. Eventually, he finally got Danny Garcia in the ring and he beat him. Now Danny Garcia is asking for a rematch. Now don't get me wrong, Danny Garcia... He said in the past that he wants a rematch against Keith Thurman, but fighters always say they want a rematch after they lose to someone. It doesn't necessarily mean they really mean it. But when you go to one of your social media accounts and you basically call someone out, that's when you know for sure that Danny Garcia, he really wants the Keith Thurman fight. And he probably feels after that performance, he may have a better chance beating Thurman in a rematch than beating Porter in a rematch. But Danny Garcia, he better really be careful because if he goes in there and he loses to Keith Thurman in a rematch, that could be a devastating blow to Team Garcia. I mean, they already talked about quitting and retiring after the loss to Porter. So a third loss might really do some more psychological damage and put that final nail in the coffin for Team Garcia. So if Danny Garcia is serious about facing Keith Thurman in a rematch, then that means Keith Thurman, he has some great options. Keith Thurman, he called out Manny Pacquiao after his last fight. And once again, just because of how he looked in this fight, Manny Pacquiao may actually be considering getting in a ring with Keith Thurman. Now, of course, Floyd Mayweather, he may have other plans because I'm sure he wants to secure that fight and beat Manny Pacquiao again before one of these young Lions get in the ring and beat Manny Pacquiao first. So we'll see what Floyd Mayweather decides to do. We'll see what Keith Thurman decides to do. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. Hey guys, make sure if you guys are training and you're looking to improve your rhythm, your coordination, your defense, reflexes, and foot movement, make sure you guys cop the Focus Ball. Go ahead and go to thefocusball.com not only will this help you guys in all of those categories, but if you buy one, you're also supporting the DBN channel. So that's all I got for now, guys. I'm on to the next one. Yep.